thanks for coming to Wicked Walks. In a minute I'll be showing you the best way to use the links in the post to get the most out of the directions we're going to give you. First off, you need to download on your phone the what 3 words app, which is free, and also the Footpath Route Planner, which is free. I'm going to open up a route on the Wicked Walks website, uh, which you can do from whenever your browser is on your phone. Uh, here we've got the Pulborough Brooks Walk. And as you scroll down, you'll see a few pictures, see a little bit about the um, walk. Uh, and then you'll come to the links, which are these colour boxes. So to find the location, which is the what three words, you're going to click on that. And as long as you've got the what three words app loaded on your phone, that'll take you straight into the map uh, where you can go to park your car or whatever. And then click navigate down at the bottom and you can choose whatever navigation system you like. Um, I usually use Apple Maps because I've got an iPhone but you might have um, Waze, you might have Google Maps, whatever. So you then click the one that you want to use, uh, put your directions in, and that will then give you directions from where you are straight down to the, the location. Uh, and when you click go, you can just follow that. Starting route. Uh, Head northwest on Maringdean Road. And just take you straight there. So that's uh, what three words the ways to find your way to the walk that you're going to. Uh, the next thing, you can check the weather, well that's pretty self-explanatory, you can just tap that and that'll take you to the BBC weather forecast, tell you what the weather's going to be like on your walk. Um, but the downloading the map, click that, and that'll load it straight into the Footpath Planner app, as long as you've got that, um, you can use it straight away, and then if you click save up at the top, you can save the route onto your phone, you won't have to download that again. And uh, that's all there is to it really. When you get there you'll see your little dot wherever you are at the, at the time. And uh, you just follow it round the route. If you get a little bit confused, they do have a cue sheet uh, to tell you where to go, how to follow it. But generally I just follow the um, blue line. If you get lost or walk out of the way, then simply just walk back towards the blue line. It couldn't be easier. Then anything else that's uh, interesting on that walk, you also have links to this one. Uh, there's a pub, you can just click the link. It'll take you straight to the pub's website. Find out about it, find out if you need to book. And there you go.